This is the first time that a long-term animal feeding trial has examined the impact of feeding GM corn or the herbicide Roundup or a combination of both and the results are extremely serious. In the male rats there were liver and kidney disorders including tumours and even more worryingly in the female rats there were mammary tumours at a level which is extremely concerning. Up to 80% of the female rats had mammary tumours by the end of the trial. What sets this study apart from all previous studies is primarily the duration. It's the first to have looked over the entire lifespan of the rats, 700 days. Anything previously has only looked out to 90 days. So the severe adverse effects that accumulated over time in these rats only began to appear four months after the study began and then escalated from then onwards, which means that all the previous studies, which were only up to 90 days, just missed the, the, missed the impact completely. GM corn is widely grown in America and millions of tons a year are being imported into this country and fed to pigs, chickens and dairy cows. So we're eating the GM corn processed through animals. In the case of Roundup, it's the world's most popular weed killer. It's advertised on television for use in people's gardens. It's used on a huge scale growing crops in this country and residues at levels which this research trial suggests could be harmful to human health in the long term are finding their way into our food.